Welcome to Fast Training Week. And remember that the topic this week is Keto Calm. Let's all make some ketones so we can calm our brain and calm our body. And remember that if you need support, we have a free group. The Resetter Collaborative is on Facebook. Just put Resetter Collaborative in your comments and we'll send you a link. If you need guided support, join us in our Reset Academy. We have an incredible community there, an incredible uh, resource of guides that can help you through this week. I'm over there in the Academy. And if you want all of this written out, all the different fasts, make sure that you put companion guide in the comments and we'll send you a link. The last thing I'm gonna tell you is make sure the point of this week is to be calm. So we love fasting to calm us. We love the ketogenic diet to calm us. There are some other strategies we can use like breathing. So check out Wim Hof breathing, check out Soma breathing. We have links on the companion guide. But as always, this is a powerful week for us to all be making ketones. Excited to be joining you in this process. If you love this information, send it out into the world. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Welcome. We are a community of people that are tapping into the miracle that our body was designed to be. Welcome. Okay, welcome to day one of Fast Training Week. And this week, this five day period of fasting, I am calling the Keto Calm Fast Training Week. So go, if this is brand new to you, please go back and watch the video I did introducing our theme for this week and talking about what Fast Training Week exactly is. On this video, what I wanna do is really address what ketones are because so many of you, and I've gotten myself caught in this pattern, it, are really searching for more ketones, wanting to see that higher number on the meter like it's some kind of badge of honor. And it is a really cool experience to start to see your body make ketones. But I wanna take your knowledge to another level and I wanna talk about, well, what exactly is a ketone? And as we move through the week, I wanna show you how ketones are amazing for fat burner. They're even a more amazing for brain repair. And we'll show you as the week goes on. So let's start off with this idea. When you eat a meal that's high in sugar, we call it a glycemic index. So foods that are high on the glycemic index, these are your processed flours, sugars, alcohol. Um, we've even talked on this channel about processed oils. What happens is it elevates your blood sugar. And when your blood sugar goes up, what the body does is it has to release insulin to connect with, that, with the sugar that your body has elevated from food. It has to put it into the cells. So glucose and insulin come together, they create an energetic uh, reaction inside the cells, and when you eat, you feel energized. That is how it should typically work. But what happens is so many people, especially when we went low fat, when we tried to do this low fat diet for many, many years, so many people went to a higher sugar diet. This happens a lot, um, sometimes even in plant-based foods is where we're just putting so many carbohydrates into our body that our, our blood sugar is elevating. And our cells become saturated. They get too much sugar in there. When the cells become saturated, the body has to have a place where it can start to so store that extra sugar. And the first place it's gonna store it is in your liver. That is the very first place that it'll go to. Once it starts to get into a pattern of storing sugar into your liver, it will store it as fat. Now remember, I've said this before, and I, this is such a key point I want you guys to understand, which is when your body decides to store sugar in fat, it is saving your life. It is a good thing. So even though you might hate it, you don't like the way it looks in the mirror, but if it didn't store it in fat, it would have to start storing it in other organs. So that would be the first thing I would tell you is remember that if you are accumulating more and more fat, there's a good chance that your cells are saturated and you're insulin resistant. You're not able to get those sugar and insulin molecules to connect. Your liver may be overworking and congested. And so the only place that your body has left to store this extra sugar is in fat. So when we do something like that we're doing this week in fast training week, 
what we're doing is we're trying to undo this process. So how you do that is by lowering your blood sugar. There are two ways that you can lower your blood sugar. You can eat lower glycemic foods, foods that are lower in the carbohydrate load. You can also fast. So this is why in the Keto Calm theme, what we're doing is we're doing a 24 hour fast. I say somewhere between 22 to 24 hours. And we're having you bring your carbohydrate load down. And I'm having you bring your, uh, your protein to a moderate amount and lean into some good fat. What that will do is you will start to see on your blood reader that your blood sugar is coming down. As your blood sugar comes down, it creates a reaction where the body starts to break down stored fat. So the lower your blood sugar, the lower it will be, the more it will signal to the fat, hey, start to break down fat because I stored blood sugar here years ago. When it breaks that fat down, those fatty acids will go to the liver and it will signal to the liver to make ketones. That is the chemical reaction. So it starts by lowering blood sugar. Then it, the second step is your body starts to break down fats. And when it breaks down fats, those go to the liver and the liver makes ketones. Now you'll see in tomorrow's video and the other videos, I'm gonna talk about what these ketones do. But we're starting today with this idea that ketones are a sign that the body's burning fat. It's also a sign that the liver is healing. It's a really, really good thing. But we've got to work here. This is step one. We've got to work on bringing blood sugar down. And we do that by bringing your carbohydrate load down and by starting to fast a little longer. So it really this week, it doesn't matter which fast you're on, all three of the fasting options I gave you is, are bringing blood sugar down. The trick, and what we want to see on that ketone reader, is that you're breaking down fat and the liver is starting to make ketones. The number you're looking for on your ketone reader is anything above 0.5. That is the indicator that the body has made this, this chemical reaction and you're now into ketosis. You're now training your body to be a fat burner. And that's a beautiful thing.